On Wing is a lecture given by His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on January 24th, 1977, in Bhubaneswara, India. Krishna consciousness is not reserved for any particular person or nation or religion. <coughs> the central point is that one must understand what is Krishna. The other day, Somebody inquired, what is the meaning of Krishna? Krishna means all attractive. Unless God is all attractive, uh, how he can become God? So Vrindavan life means Krishna comes, descends himself to show what is Krishna, what is God. So the picture, Vrindavan life, that is village life, uh, there are villagers, cultivators, cows, calves, that is Vrindavan. It is not a big city like New York, London. It is village. And the central point is Krishna. This is Vrindavan life. There, the gopis, they are village girls, and the cowherd boys, they are also village boys. Nanda Maharaj is the head of the village, uh, agriculturist. Similarly, the elderly person, and the elderly gopis, Madhav Yasoda and her other friends, all are attracted by Krishna. They even did not know what is Krishna. They did not know by reading Vedas, Puranas, Vedanta to understand Krishna. But their natural affection was for Krishna. So this Havavita Akarsan can be at the present moment we have no natural attraction for Krishna. Therefore we must understand uh, by knowledge what is Krishna. That is Krishna Tattavitta. So why one should be attracted to Krishna unless Krishna has all the attractive features. The attraction generally in this material world, we are attracted to a rich man uh, or to a powerful man, man or woman, uh, just like our Prime Minister, she is woman. But because she is powerful, we are attracted. We talk of her. So the points of attraction are discussed by Parasar Muni as bhava. Bhava means opulence. So these opulences, when one is very rich, he is opulent. One is very powerful, he is attractive. One is very influential, one is very beautiful, one is very highly learned. In this way, attraction. So if we scrutinizingly study the life of Krishna, you will find in the history of the world there was a richer person than Krishna no powerful person than Krishna, no beautiful person than Krishna, more uh, learned and person of knowledge, philosophy than Krishna. If you study, 
will find everything. The six opulences are fully represented in Krishna. Therefore, he is Bhagavan. Bhagavan means opulences and ban means one who possesses. This is the meaning of Krishna that he is all attractive because he possesses all the six opulences. This is the description of Krishna. So we should not accept anyone and everyone as Bhagavan. We must test whether he has got these six opulences. A person who is begging from door to door, and when there is some bodily pain, he immediately goes to the doctor, uh, to take her, please give me medicine. So does it mean that he is Bhagavan? A Bhagavan cannot cure his tooth pain even. This class of Bhagavan, we should not accept. Uh, Bhagavan is described in the Bhagavad Gita Asama Urdha. Nobody can be equal to Bhagavan, and nobody can be greater than Bhagavan. Therefore, Sri uh, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu Yes, particularly, Jai Krishna Tattva Vetta Sai Guru. One who knows Krishna uh, specifically, not superficially, but in all details, what is the meaning of Krishna, what is Krishna, he can become Guru. Krishna uh, says in Bhagavad Gita about himself, Krishna tattva about the truth about Krishna, we can understand from Bhagavad Gita with our intelligence. Just like Krishna describes that matta parataram nanyat kinchi jasti dhananya. Now we study this one line that Krishna says there is nobody greater than me. Now you study Krishna's life, compare with anyone, and you will find, yes, nobody is greater or equal to Krishna. So, at the present moment, the defect is that people are not very uh, serious to understand of Krishna, because in this age, as it is stated in the Srimad Bhagavatam, about the people of this age, prayena alpayusa kalauvasmin jugejana manda samanda matayo manda vādhyā upadvita. Prayena alpayusa. People are living not as they used to live formerly. In this age, Kalijo, the maximum years one can live hundred years uh, in this Kali Yoga, hundred years. In the Dhapar Yoga, it was uh, one thousand years. In the Tatar Yoga, it was ten thousand years. In the Sattva Yoga, it was one hundred thousand years. It is using Kali Yoga means the a duration of age will reduce, the memory will reduce, the bodily strength will reduce, mercifulness will reduce. In this way everything will reduce. This is Kali Yuga. Supply of food stuff will be reduced. This is Kali Yuga. Samandha. Everyone is bad. Not full strength. Samandha samandha matayo. And everyone has got a samandha mat. What means opinion or system, which is also sumanda, not only manda, but sumanda. Everyone is manufacturing a type of Bhagavan, a type of religious system. That is not bona fide at all. The sumanda mat. Manda, sumanda matayo. And everyone is unfortunate. Manda bhagya. Unfortunate in this sense. They do not know what is the aim of life, 
how human life should make progress. So you can read the explanation of this. One should not think that because Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was born a Brahmana and was situated in the topmost spiritual order as a sannyasi, it was improper for him to receive instructions from Srila Ramananda Roy, who belonged to the Shudra caste. Jai Bhajeshai Boro Avakpahin Chha Krishna Bhajanate Nahi Jati Kuladi Bicha. This is Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. There is no such distinction that one is lower and higher in the matter of Krishna consciousness moment. In the Shastra, it is clearly stated that unless one is Krishna conscious, he cannot become guru. Satkarma nipuna vipra mantra tantra visharada avaishnava guru nasasya shad vaishnava sabato guru. It is said that a Brahman, even though he is well qualified, Satkarma, Brahmana, six occupations, Satkarma, Pathan, Pathan, Jajan, Jajan, Dana, Patigra. Uh, Satkarma, Nipuna, Vipra, Mantra, Tantra, Vishar. And he is well expert in Vedic hints, Vedic understanding, Mantra, Tantra, Mantra, Tantra. Everything is competent. But always now, if he is not a devotee of Krishna, he cannot become guru. Shad Vaishnava Sabacho Guru. But if a Vaishnava, even though he may come from the Chandala family, Sapasa, the dog eater's family, that is considered the lowest in the man, in man society. If he becomes a Vaishnava, uh, he is fit for becoming spiritual master. This is the Shastra. Our uh, Guru, out of the six Goswamins, one of them, he has given his direction in the Bhakti, uh, what is that? Vilar, that Avaishnava Mukhadjina Puta Hari Katham Mitam Savanam Nakastabhau. A person who is not Vaishnava, Vaishnava means Krishna Tattvita. If he is not well versed in the science of Krishna, if his behavior is not Vaishnava, Sadatar Sampurna, Vaishnava must have Dadastila, Sita, Sutra, Kanti, and there are uh, many things just keep that. Sadata Sampanna Vaishnava. If he is not that, simply by education, if he uh, uh, <coughs> speaks about Krishna, one should not hear. One should not hear. This is a professional man. If you pay him something, he will speak for some time. But his behavior is not Vaishnava. So from such person, it is forbidden to hear about Srimad Bhagavatam or anything about Krishna. Avaishnava Mukadhina Puta Hari Katham Mitam Savanam Nakatam Bam. So one may say that he is speaking about Krishna. So what is wrong there? He may be misbehaved, but speaking about Krishna, so that Sanatam Goswami says, Pūta Hari Kathāmṛtam. Hari Kathāmṛtam is always pure, that's our life. But, Avaśrava Mukhaddīnna Pūta Hari Kathāmṛtam. Sivarana Khvai Sarpa Chishta Payo Jatha. Everyone knows, milk is very nice, nutritious food. But if it is touched by the leaves of a serpent, it is quiet, no more to be. So uh, it is forbidden that we should not try to understand about Krishna from a person who is not Vaishnava. At the present moment, there are so called scholars, politicians, or philosophers. They have nothing to do 
with Krishna or Krishna Bhakti, but just to take advantage of the Bhagavad Gita, they are explaining Bhagavad Gita in their own way. So if we want to derive actual benefit from the Bhagavad Gita, we must uh, approach such person who has uh, understood what is Krishna. So therefore, Krishna gives the direction that vidhi pranipātena pariprasnena sevaya upadakṣanti tadhyāna jñāna tattu darsuna. We should approach, we must approach Gai Krishna tattva We must learn from him about Krishna. Then we can understand. Other is not. We are giving this jaggo to the Europeans and Americans because they are now qualified. Uh, sometimes we are criticized in India that Bhaktivedanta Sami is spoiling Hindu religion. But it is not actually the fact. We are increasing the number of Hindus. Unfortunately, there's our, uh, this uh, European American uh, disciples, uh, these so-called Brahmin priests of Jagannath Puri, they do not allow. Arche Shilaji, uh, everyone knows in the temple, just that Jagannath, everyone knows Jagannath is made of wood, uh, or in other temples made of stone. But people do they come to see wood and stone? So if anyone thinks, sometimes they at his class they think, that this foolish man, they are going to see a piece of wood. Uh, this is Naraki Buddha. Similarly, Achi Vishnu Siladhi Guru Sunaramati. Those who are acting as Guru according to this description. If somebody thinks that this man is ordinary person. And Vaishnava is Ati Buddha. Similarly, Charanamrita, Gangaja, if somebody thinks ordinary word, so he is Naraki. So these Europeans and Americans who are properly initiated according to the Vaishnava system, according to Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's indication, if somebody thinks that Jati, Angrej Jati or American Jati, he is Naraki, what can be done? Why one should not hear from one who has got sufficient knowledge on Lord Krishna, if he is not outwardly a Vaishnava? That means he is not having Kita or Kanti like that. Oh, yeah. So what's wrong with hearing from someone if he has some knowledge of Krishna, even if he doesn't have a seeker and tilak and what have you? That is the injection of authority. Avaishnava mukhadgina puta harika. We have to abide by the orders of the superior. Why? There is no question. Authority says we have to accept it. You cannot say why. Vedic injunction. Therefore, Krishna was accepted as Guru by Arjun. Sishasri and Sadhimam. Prapanna. Because as friend and friend, the uh, reply and argument will go on. To stop this argument, Krishna is accepted as guru, not as friend. Similarly, when you accept the guru, you must accept guru according to the Vedic principle. Uh, so here, guru, Sanatana Goswami, is giving the injunction that always nava mukhadvīna, pūta hari katāṁ, savanāṁ nā katāṁ. The exceptional case is the, uh, different, uh, the paramhāṁsa state. But a guru, although he is paramhāṁsa, because he is teaching, he comes down as madhama dhikāri. There are three kinds of vaśnava, kanishta dhikāri, madhama dhikāri, and Uttama Dikari. 
उत्तम अधिकारी मे बी विदाउट कंठी विदाउट शिखा विदाउट वैष्णव सिम्टम्स ही इज फॉर अंस बट वेन ही कम्स टू दी प्रीचिंग प्लेटफॉर्म ही मस्ट बिकम ए मौधम अधिकारी नॉट टू इमिटेट उत्तम अधिकारी बिकॉज ही हैज टू टीच ही कैन नॉट डिविएट फ्रॉम द टीचिंग प्रिंसिपल सो वॉट यू आर स्पीकिंग so without sikha without country one can become guru that is fact for the paramahamsa not for the preacher preacher must behave very nicely question was why there is a chaotic situation in i think if i am understanding him correctly why there is a chaotic situation if god is to uplift the soul of the all the persons all the living why there is a chaotic situation समथिंग एंड यू डू समथिंग Krishna says that even parampara praptam imang rajar chayo vidu sakale na jogunasta paranta par. Krishna says that this Bhagavad Gita imang dupasati jogam pratvana amamyam dushan manuviprahu manuikhaga vidhavit. Krishna says the way of studying Bhagavad Gita, but you do not accept Krishna's instruction. You read. Or Raskar's Bhagavad Gita commentary. Then how is this going to be uh, chaotic condition? You do not follow. He strictly prays. Even from from prapa, sakali and yoga nasta paranta. Yoga nasta. As soon as the parampara system is not accepted, the so-called commentary on Bhagavad Gita is lost or rotten. So you are interested with the rotten commentary of so-called politicians, scholars. They have been getting money. Therefore, it is clear. Lord Krishna, please, Bhagavad Gita, 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 Out of his uh, meditation or how the actual thing, which was conveyed to Arjuna, was again uh, in the real thing took a shape in the form of Bhagavad Gita. Was that that you have no intelligence to understand, but uh, what is uh, given by Basde, that is accepted by all the acharyas. We are uh, not so learned as you are. But we are follow the Acharya, and it is recommended in the Bhagavad Gita. Acharya upasan. You must follow the Acharya, the Ramana Acharya, Madhya Acharya, even Sankara Acharya, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Then you will get the real answer. Acharya Vaan Purusha Vira, one who follows the Acharya, he knows. Others they do not know. So you cannot question. But uh, how Basde uh, uh, wrote that is stated in the Bhagavad Gita. Uh, Sanjay says Basu Pasala. How one can understand by the mercy of Basu? So uh, we have to see instead of criticizing in that adverse way, we have to follow the Acharya. आचार्य उपासनम तो यू फाइंड रामानुचार्य मध्याचार्य विष्णु स्वामी निम्बार्क श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभु दे हैव एक्सेप्टेड इन दैट वे सो व्हाट इज यूज ऑफ आवर क्वेश्चन वी शुड फॉलो महाजन जी ने गत स्वतंत्रता अदर इज दिस नॉट Thank you. 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 Thank you.
इंद्रजन फॉर दी नॉन डिवोटी ना हम प्रकाश सर्वस्व जुग माया समाप्त बट फॉर डिवोटी इज विजिबल प्रेमान जन चुरित भक्ति विलोचन है ना संत सदैव हृदय सुविलोकन दोज वार रियल डिवोटी ऑफ गॉड देर ट्वेंटी फोर आवर्स सेंग है विद इन दी हार्ट सो गॉड इज नॉट इन बिजी इन बिजी फॉर दी एथिस्ट What is invisible? God wants that these rascal may remain in darkness. They cannot understand Krishna. Let them remain in darkness. That God wants. Now your answer is this: that why God does? God wants that these so-called uh, Brahmins who eat Jagannath Prasad, who feed, let them remain in darkness, not to understand who is Krishna. Now that is true. Take it that. Tara ham dise ta Quran chibami adat sa ham dun jani. Those are Vishnu Desi, Bhagavad Desi. God keeps them in darkness for future. Our what is the reason between man and God? That is what we have to understand. Three upper understood come to the school and learn it, not in a minute. Uh, then why you are asking all these things? You come become a student and learn. It is not so easy subject. That's standing for one minute you will understand everything. Not standing, God. It is God is not doing everything. God is doing everything. I have already explained. If you want to remain a demon, God will keep you in demonic condition. That's it. He is doing everything. That's a fact. And if you want to be devotee. Then God can make you devotee. Jeeva Thaman Prabhadanti Tan Sutiyo Bhajan. Krishna says, "Cho, this one. Ketrogon Cho means I am also Ketrogon. Therefore, he is different from the ordinary. That's why we try to understand. Cho means different. Another. And the difference is that Sarva Ketre is Bharata, whereas The individual khetraga is within the body. Just there is no abhijit mark. Uh, there may be abhijit mark philosophy. When in Bhagavad Gita there is no abhijit mark. It is abhijit mark. Otherwise, why Krishna said, "Sarva dharman paritajya maam ekam sarana." You sarana ng bhaja. You are different from me. Krishna said. Otherwise, why Krishna asked that you sarana? That you and I differ. That is the story. Then you can understand anything, but that is not the thing. We have to take it as it is. We are there to present in Bhagavad Gita. God is commanding you that you surrender. So you are different from God. That that is surrender means I am. I am not a doer. I am not doing anything. God, who is deciding with you? Surrender, who is surrender? Unless you are servant, why should you surrender? By doing, you are servant. God is master. So, so therefore, master and servant differ. I am not God, but God is everybody. That's all. God is everybody. And the dog and everything. Everybody. God is in the is in dog. Therefore, dog. Does it mean God is dog also? No, God is not God. God is the. You are putting the same idea because God is there within God. Therefore, God is God. Yes, yes, they are talking like that. There is no Nara. God is everywhere. That is understood. But that does not mean God says, "Mastani sabu bhutani na ham teesu abhisita." Why don't you read this? No, that is not.